A chariot is a kind of a cart that you see in the movie Ben-Hur. You can see here, an axis and the two wheels behind the head of sphinxes. The booklet contains the keywords of power, labor, and success. It also contains the negative keywords as well, such as war, revenge, and suffering. Those words seem a little value to me. What would be a good advice to the person who is reading the card? When you look at the card, there is a man standing in the middle, and two sphinxes are at the bottom on both sides. The man in the center must be the main character, but note that the name of the card is the chariot, not the warrior. Come to think of it, the previous card was the lovers, not the love. Let's look at the color first. One may assume that the card of the chariot should be painted with powerful and active colors, but the colors of this card are rather similar to those of the high priestess, which represents static and passive wisdom. The contrast between black and white, the bluish clothing, and even the yellow crescent are shown in this card. When you look at closely, the two sphinxes are sitting still, and are not even reined in. You can find that this man is not going forward. There is a castle in the background, and the sky is filled with yellow, representing hope and prospect. The stars dotted all over the curtain and his forehead, also stand for the hope and trust. This man must be following his own stars. We can see that the card is giving advice to the one who is following their own dreams. What kind of advice would it be? This card emphasizes the importance of balance. The balance within himself, and the balance around himself. The two sphinxes with different colors and orientations, show that you need to balance your outside conditions. There are rising and falling moons on his shoulders, each with different facial expression. This symbolizes the two faces of your mind, the balance within yourself. If either of the balances are off, the chariot will not be able to go straight, and go astray or be capsized. There is only a small fraction of red, symbolizing action. There is a red top in the middle of the chariot. It represents lingam and yoni, which means the connection of two extremes. This may mean that if you balance yourself without being biased, you can fly as you wish. The yellow background also promises you of the endless possibilities. In order to do that, you should not just try whatever comes into your mind. As the blue clothes symbolize, you need to think deeply before moving into action. Everything may look ready, but do not hurry. Just be a little bit more careful, and try balancing yourself without bias.